All right, guys. So we move on to the next part. That is finding out the square root of a third. Okay. Now to understand the square root of a third, let's first understand how to square a third, right? So if you take two plus root three, okay. In this uh, particular question, I have written two is rational part and root three is the irrational part. So two plus root root three still is an irrational number. It's a third. Okay. Now when you square it, you'll be reminded of a plus b the whole square ka formula. So this can be directly written as two square. Plus two into two into root three plus root three ka square a square plus two ab plus b square. Okay, when you simplify this, okay, two square becomes four, root three square becomes three, four plus three becomes seven. So you can uh, write the whole term as seven plus four root three. Now, if I ask you what is the square root of seven plus four root three, okay, you will tell me that abhi toh square kiya hai a square plus two ab plus b square. Okay, so whenever I ask you the square root of a third, we should visualize this particular third as a square plus two ab plus b square. So uh, if I ask you the square root of seven plus four root three, you should be able to visualize this part as two square plus root three square plus two into two into root three. What is your inspiration? It is this step here: a square plus two ab plus b square, isn't it? Right, so this uh, the same logic we'll try to apply in the upcoming questions. Okay, where we'll be asked to find out the square root of a third. Let's talk about five plus root twenty four ka square root. Firstly, five plus root twenty four may root twenty four is written in the pure third form, right? So, हम लोग पहले क्या करेंगे? From this root twenty four, we write it as root of four into six. Four ka square root is two. So basically, I am asking you the square root of five plus two root six. Okay. Now I'll try to visualize this as a square plus two ab plus b square. Okay, so if you observe the two root six ka term, always remember, जहाँ भी अपना root का sign रहेगा, radical sign रहेगा, that will be the term for two ab. Because guys, whenever you write a square and b square, root का sign तो निकल गया होगा, right? So the only point where you can observe the two ab ka term will be the root sign, which in this case is two root six. Okay, so I want a number. Okay, the two ab. ओके जिनमें प्रोडक्ट इज टू रूट सिक्स ओके एंड द सम ऑफ द स्क्वायर ए स्क्वायर टू बी स्क्वायर शुड बी फाइव ओके द ओनली वे यू कैन स्प्लिट दिस इज व्हेन यू राइट रूट सिक्स एज रूट टू मल्टीप्लाइड बाय रूट थ्री द थर्ड प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ एंड राइट सो द लेटर पार्ट हियर फाइव प्लस टू रूट सिक्स वाला पार्ट टू रूट सिक्स कैन बी रिटर्न एज टू इंटू रूट टू इंटू रूट थ्री और राइट नाउ इफ यू ऑब्जर्व दिस इट्स वेरी वेरी क्लियर द फाइव विल नॉट बी रिटर्न एज रूट टू स्क्वायर प्लस रूट थ्री स्क्वायर आ गया अपना एक्सपांशन ए स्क्वायर प्लस बी स्क्वायर प्लस टू ए बी सो वेरी क्लियरली दिस इज द एक्सपांशन फॉर रूट टू प्लस रूट थ्री द होल स्क्वायर राइट और रूट थ्री प्लस रूट टू द होल स्क्वायर विच एवर यू प्रेफर ऑल राइट सो फाइंडिंग द स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ दिस टर्म द रूट ऑफ दिस विल बी रूट टू प्लस रूट थ्री ओके नाउ यू मे आस्क जब हमने यहाँ पे रूट टू प्लस रूट थ्री स्क्वायर लिखा है वाई कॉन्ट इट बी हैविंग द वैल्यू माइनस ऑफ रूट टू प्लस रूट थ्री द होल स्क्वायर ओके सी यहाँ पे द क्वेश्चन आस्क इज रूट ऑफ फाइव प्लस रूट ट्वेंटी फोर यू ऑलरेडी हैव अ रूट साइन आउट साइड ओके सो द आंसर के नॉट बी नेगेटिव हेन्स आई विद नॉट द माइनस साइन यूर ओके फाइनल आंसर माइनस साइन नहीं आ सकता राइट बिकॉज वी हैव स्टडीड इस इन नंबर थियरी वेन एवर यू हैव रूट ऑफ एनी पॉजिटिव नंबर आंसर हैज टू बी पॉजिटिव Right, so answer will be root of root two plus root three the whole square. It's going to be plus root two plus root three. All right. Uh, taking inspiration, we go on to the next question. Seven minus root forty-eight. Now, a uh, seven minus root forty-eight can be written as a uh, root forty-eight is basically sixteen uh, into three ka root. Sixteen ka root is four. So this question is basically finding out the square root of seven minus four root three. All right. Now, very clearly, you can observe the four root three can be written as two into two into root three, such that two square plus root three square is seven. Got the point? It's as easy, as simple as that. So the question is basically two square plus root three square minus two into two into root three a square plus b square minus two ab. Okay, so this will be two minus root three the whole square. ओके रूट थ्री माइनस टू हो सकता था अदरवाइज बट एज आई टोल्ड यू देर इज अ रेडिकल साइन देर इज अ स्क्वायर रूट का सिंबल आउटसाइड ओके सो द रूट कैन नॉट बी नेगेटिव वी सॉल्व इन द वेरी फर्स्ट क्लासेस स्टार्टिंग क्लासेस ऑफ मॉड्यूल वन राइट स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ पॉजिटिव नंबर हैज टू बी पॉजिटिव 
right? So the answer will be square root of 7 minus 48. Root 48 is 2 minus root of 3. So, uh, let's see. Find root of x plus 1 upon root x given that x is 2 root 2 plus 3. Okay, now it's a direct application of what we saw just now, right? x is given as 2 root 2 plus 3. But in the question, you are interested to find out root of x plus 1 upon root of x. So first calculate the square root, the positive square root of 2 root 2 plus 3. Okay, so 2 root 2 can be split as 2 into 1 into root 2 such that the 3 will be split as root 2 square plus 1 square. Ho gaya ye, a square plus b square plus 2ab. So this is nothing but root 2 plus 1 the whole square. So, when we square root, if you want to find out root of x, so root of x will simply be equal to root 2 plus 1. Okay, this is only half the solution right now. We want to find out root x plus 1 upon root x, right? So, we substitute the value of root x here. Root 2 plus 1 plus 1 upon root x, which is root 2 plus 1. Okay, now guys, you can proceed by cross multiplying the given terms. Root 2 plus 1 into root 2 plus 1. Cross multiply karke, right with the common denominator. Or you can also rationalize the denominator. Rationalize means you ensure that the denominator of this term is basically a rational number. Okay. So in the process of rationalizing, we multiply and divide by the conjugate of the third. Conjugate means the term which has the same two numbers. Okay. But with the opposite sign. So root 2 plus 1 go be multiplied by root 2 minus 1. All right. So in the denominator, it is a plus b into a minus b, which is a square minus b square. Right. So this part can be simplified as root 2 plus 1 remaining intact as such plus upar agya, root 2 minus 1 and niche a square root 2 square minus 1 square. What is root 2 square guys? 2 minus 1 square is 1. 2 minus 1 is 1. That means a denominator is simply equal to 1. Don't bother anything about this now. So root 2 plus 1 plus root 2 minus 1 is the required answer, plus 1 minus 1 gets cancelled and you have your final answer which is 2 root 2. That's all.